Nami Bog, remember, no Russian. Let's go. That right there, guys, was the Horizon Modern Warfare intro, the replacement client for H2M. What's going on, guys? It's Wild Child, and today we're finally playing the new Modern Warfare 2 Remastered mod update. The new client just came out today, and I'm finally getting my hands on it. Let's get in this bad boy. Looks relatively the same. Um, of course, we do have now a new featured tab here on the bottom left corner. Make sure to go and support those devs that have been working on this mod. They've been putting a lot of work into this mod to get it out there, to get it polished. There's still lots of work to be done. There's still lots of content and updates to come, but... We got to give props because without them, we would not have a launcher and a revival to this mod. So I'll go over all the new stuff that's came out today in a second. But let's take a look at the creative classes. Let's see. Okay, so I have my creative class. I got the UMP class. Wait, whoa. What's going on here? <laughs> I got four arms. Holy shit. Well, I guess we're starting off this gameplay as a freak. Um, that is definitely a new bug, but I guarantee that will be gone very, very soon. It's kind of funny, but anyway, let's get into a let's get into a game here. Um, there isn't that many servers as it is launch day. I mean, this is only a few hours since it just came out, so you have to understand there's still not as many people on, and there's not going to be as many servers as this is a new master server that's out for the new client. All right, guys, we finally loaded up into a game here, but I want to give you guys the full rundown of everything that's come out today and has been updated with the new hmw client so let's get started on it the first thing is that's come out with horizon modern warfare is the new launcher no more having to download a bunch of leaked build across the internet and manually installing it into your modern warfare files nope you simply just need to download the launcher out of their discord and it will do all the work for you and get the mod prepared you don't have to do anything besides just downloading the launcher putting it into your files and you're good to go any updates that come out for the clients will also be automatically updated for you because of the launcher so the launcher is going to help so much getting everybody easily able to access this mod finally and it just oh it just makes it great everybody's going to be on the same version now everything's going to be organized and it's just amazing not only that but you do get patch notes on the launcher as well so you know every time when they update what are the new additions super easy super nice super helpful i'm really glad we finally have a launcher for this mod the next thing is they also added a new master server so that means you know new master server there's gonna be even more servers than before it's gonna be a little bit smoother the server browser is gonna be improved and has already been and that is great Unfortunately, there isn't as many servers right now as this is a new master server. It just came out today, but there will be more servers transferred over to the new one over the course of the next few days. So if you don't have any you know, servers that you played on or necessarily have that good ping, give it some time. All the people are trying to transfer their servers over and that will help a lot more people also be able to play. The next thing is, and this is another big thing, but now the h2m mod is open source thanks to the hmw dev team they were able to get this h2m mod open source so now anyone can just download it mess with it do what they want to make their own projects it's amazing it means that this is literally not going anywhere activision can suck it the next big thing that's been added today is voice chat this was a big thing that everybody wanted it's finally here we have voice chat support and the best part is it sounds like it's mic quality from straight out of 2009. One of the best additions I think in this is also now the new server updates. No more kicking you out after every end of a match. You are now staying in the server and guess what? You can full on functionally vote for the next map with your controller, with your keyboard. It's not going to be buggy. It all works. Everything works. You're not getting kicked out. You're going to continue to stay in the server, get new matches. It works as intended now. This is 
great. That was so annoying in the leaked build, just getting kicked out after a match or not even like being able to vote on the next map because your controller just didn't function with it properly. That is not a problem anymore. Not every single server has map voting, but the best part about it is, is even if they don't have map voting, you're not going to get kicked out of the server after the end of the match. So this is great news. There's just been a lot of quality of life improvements done to servers and server browsers, and you will definitely see that once playing on the new client. Now, some other big changes is the weapons and guns. They went back and did some weapon balancing. All of the weapon values have now been adjusted to more accurately match the original Modern Warfare 2. This was something that you could kind of notice because literally every gun was so OP. And while that was also true to the original Modern Warfare 2, you could tell that there was still some slight differences to the original game. So they did go and tweak all of these values to get it more accurate to the original modern warfare 2 so now your gun should feel more like the originals not only that but they did fix the foregrip and it now works as intended the magnum akimbos now reload faster than if you just have a magnum by itself and then another thing is players are invisible when being looked at through glass with a thermal sight another thing they also changed was that well Switching to your sidearm is now faster than reloading. Yep, that's been fixed up. And another thing is the Predator missile has also been tweaked with and is now working a little bit better, uh, better sounds, and also you can boost it. So that is great. However, I think it is still pretty buggy because from what I've been seeing in the Discord, some people have been trying to get the Predator missile out and they instead whip out a knife. And so, yeah. Still a little bugged, but don't worry. They're going to be updating this client, patching all the things out. You know, the best thing is, is that it's even out right now. Now, the last adjustments that they have made are just some like minor bug fixes, like hard point timers, headquarters timers, you know, capture the flag spawn issues, claymore detonation issues, um, floating bodies. You know, there's going to be less floating bodies. However, I've seen still quite a bit, uh, but they shouldn't occur as much. And uh, just some other things that were more quality of life improvements uh, from bugs that we were constantly dealing with in game. So there is a lot of adjustments. Another thing is perks I want to mention real quick. Bling Pro now functions with all secondary weapons and Scavenger works with launchers. So that's pretty much the entire patch notes. If you guys want to read them all, I'll have them down in the description. And they are also in the Discord server and in the HMW client launcher so make sure to go read them if you guys want to you know check it out um but yeah that's pretty much everything that's came with today's update nothing crazy there still is a lot to come the thing is is the client is just ready to be played on there's still lots of things to be planned lots of features to come that were talked about before but we have to give them more time. The thing is, is their first goal was just to get the client ready and at a state that it could be playable and be ready to be worked on. That was the biggest goal to start with first, and they've managed to achieve that. Now they can get on to other projects with HMW, like the new features and so on and so forth. So that is pretty much it in terms of everything that's coming. And this is HMW for you guys. Basically just H2M, but more polished and ready to be updated and with a lot more content on the way. If you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you guys do leave a like. I'm going to go and play some more of this. I will see you guys on there. If you have any questions, if you guys need any help, make sure to check out the Discord. That is where you can download the client and also hit me up in the comments. I got a lot more HMW content coming for you guys. So make sure you subscribe and like the video and I will see you on there. Peace.